The Arthurian Knights. By Brad, Callum, Phil, Aaron. During the winter months, Arthur and his men were hunt out hunting in the forest. But unfortunately, all the animals were hibernating. And the forest was dark, damp and lifeless. So they went back to the castle. Shortly after they arrived, there was a loud bang on the door. The guards cautiously opened the doors for Arthur. And there was a little man in a yellow tunic. And he announced, you have been invited to a duel with the giants. Arthur and his men, as they were so bored during the winter months, they were very excited. So they travelled there straight away. Arthur and his men walked for four nights and days on end. Arthur and his men fought for hours on end, but eventually won. Arthur and his men collected their treasure and then went to the pub for a good old pint of beer. As King Arthur picked up his final pint, he paused. He realised he was late for midnight mass. So he and his men set off towards the Hawkston. As King Arthur and his men got halfway, they realised they'd be late for midnight mass. So they decided to turn off onto a damp, dark, gloomy place, which turned out to be Wixel Moss. travel through the moss, some mist started to rise. First it was at their ankles, it just started to go up, up, up and over. The mist was getting thicker. The scratches on the trees are disappearing in the distance. The Arthur's face is blue. Arthur was going around in circles. He was worried. His men's hands were ice cold. Arthur was getting really, really scared. They couldn't find where they were. They were lost in the mist. Through the mist, they could see two luminous pink eyes. Behind that, they could see two glowing pink ears. They took a step forwards, and then another, and then another. Suddenly, they could see it. A great white lion stood before them. One of the soldiers said, it must be a fairy. Then, the lion turned around, almost beckoning them. They followed the lion, and slowly, but surely, it brought them to safety.